Science Guy. Brought to you by Water. Getting things wet for over 3 billion years. So did you know that almost all the water in the world, almost all the water on Earth, is the same water that's been here since the Earth was formed? Uh, it's the same water that uh, Columbus sailed on. It's the same water that uh, cave people drank. So, so when you drink a glass of water, you could be drinking what was once uh, dinosaur spit. See, water is this amazing substance. It, it can be a solid, uh, like ice. It can be a liquid, like, like you drink. It can also be a gas or a vapor. But maybe the wildest thing is that water uh, is always moving. It's what scientists, maybe a scientist like you, calls the hydrological cycle. Now, hydro, that's Greek for water. So, hydrological water cycle, you with me? <laughs> so, this is a water cycle simulator. So let's say we start right here, where, where water's a liquid. Anyway, something's making it change from a liquid into a vapor. Well, it's energy uh, from this burner, or in the real world, energy from the sun. And that's called evaporation. See, vapor, evaporation, you with me? Whenever water goes back into the air, we say that it evaporates. Evaporates. See the word vapor in there? And look right here, when it's evaporated, it's invisible. Isn't that cool? So when the water vapor gets up here, it cools off and turns back into a liquid. Now when the vapor turns back into a liquid, we call that condensation. We say it condenses. Watch sometime when mother pours hot water into the sink. When the hot steam touches the cool glass, it forms drops of water which are almost like raindrops. Heating water makes it evaporate. Cooling vapor changes it back to water. So what do you think this part of our water cycle simulator is called? Uh, way up here. What did that be like? It's like clouds. This is the clouds of our water cycle simulator. But now, Billy, what makes this vapor return to Earth as water? It rains. That's right. So down at this end, the liquid water turns into rain. It flows down here. Now, that's called precipitation. That's a word you may have heard before. Now, precipitation, that's when water's falling from the sky, like rain, snow, sleet, or hail. That's all precipitation. Anyway, it falls down and it collects in here. This could be like a lake or a stream. And then after a while, it flows to the sea to start the cycle all over again. Pretty cool. Today on the Jackie Smash Show.